Alright, here's a floating raft system that I built using a under the bed tote. Uh, averages around 10 gallons. And uh, it's got 15 slots in it, probably a little closer space than needed to be. But uh, this is my second setup. First one I used two 10 gallon totes and was able to get more plants in this one tote with the same amount of water and nutrient solution. To the right you can see a black seeded Simpson. Uh, tried those and uh, worked with those. It was the last packet of seeds I could find at the store before the end of the season. And uh, just thought I'd try them out see what they would do. And not bad. Um, for the first try they turned out I think pretty decent. Not the kind of lettuce I'm used to but uh, hey you never know. To the left you'll see some plants that were actually supposed to be cabbage. Uh, I planted cabbage seed. The package said that they were the early Jersey Wakefield, brand new package, bought from a very reputable company, ordered them over line. And um, as you can tell, that's not cabbage. I kept watching in the center to see a head form. Uh, heads never really formed. But then the bases started to swell, as you can see on that one in the front and the ones in the background, that these are actually turnips. Uh, didn't know you could do turnips in a hydroponic system if you ever wanted to know you can uh, I wouldn't suggest it but that's just me I don't eat turnips don't like turnips so don't see any profit in them but uh, if you like turnips this might be an option for you if you want to do something hydroponically and uh, just thought I'd let you know and uh, Lord willing we'll see you next time